Guided missile ships are designed to launch anti-aircraft guided missiles. Many are also equipped to carry out anti-submarine, anti-air and anti-surface operations. In addition to the guns, guided missile ships are usually equipped with large missile magazines, usually in vertical launch cells. Some of them contain powerful radar systems such as the United States Aegis Combat System. So based on a combined score of armament, displacement, armor, sensors, radars, propulsion, range, speed and many more, today the Buzz would like to rank the top 5 most powerful guided missile ships in the world. Stay tuned guys and do not miss this! The fifth most powerful guided missile ship goes to the Ticonderoga class. The Ticonderoga class of guided missile cruisers is a class of warships in the United States Navy. It has a length of 173 meters and a displacement of 9,600 long tons. The Ticonderoga class introduced a new generation of guided missile warships based on the Aegis Faced Array radar that is capable of simultaneously scanning for threats, tracking targets and guiding missiles to interception. When they were designed, they had the most powerful electronic warfare equipment in the U.S. Navy as well as the most advanced underwater surveillance system. Ticonderoga-class guided missile cruisers are multi-role warships. Their MK-41 VLS can launch Tomahawk cruise missiles to strike strategic or tactical targets or fire long-range anti-aircraft standard missiles for defense against aircraft or anti-ship missiles. The sonar systems and the LAMPS-3 helicopters, which is the Sikorsky SH-60B or MH-60R Seahawk, allow them to perform anti-submarine missions. This guided missile cruiser is powered with four General Electric LM-2500 gas turbines, two controllable reversible pitch propellers and two rudders. With this power, it provides a maximum speed of 32.5 knots and a range of 6,000 nautical miles or 11,000 kilometers. Up next at number 4 is the Kirov class which is a class of nuclear-powered guided missile cruisers of the Soviet Navy and the Russian Navy, the largest and heaviest surface combatant warships in operation in the world. Its length and displacement measures 252 meters and 28,000 tons when fully loaded. Among modern warships, they are second in size only to large aircraft carriers and of similar size to a World War I-era battleship. The ships are often referred to as battle cruisers by Western defense commentators due to their size and general appearance. The Kirov class's main weapons are 20 P-700 grenade missiles mounted in deck designed to engage large surface targets. Air defense is provided by 12 Octopole S-300F launchers with 96 missiles and a pair of OSA MA batteries with 20 missiles each. Kirov came with double SN-14 anti-submarine warfare missiles, while on subsequent ships, these were replaced with K-95 Kinzel surface-to-air missile systems. Other weapons are the automatic 130mm AK-130 gun system, 10 21-inch torpedo missile tubes and UDAF-1 with 40 anti-submarine rockets and two sextuple RBU-1000 launchers. Armor of this class is a 76mm plating around reactor compartment light splinter protection. The class is powered with two Chef Konas 2K and 3 nuclear marine propulsion with two GT3A688 steam turbines. With this power, it provides a speed of 32 knots and a range of 1,000 nautical miles or 1,900 kilometers. Up next at number 3 is the Type 055 destroyer. This is a class of stealth-guided missile destroyers being constructed for the Chinese People's Liberation Army Navy Surface Force and it has a length of 180 meters and a displacement of 13,000 tons when fully loaded. It is a multi-mission design. The combination of sensors and weapons suggests a main role of area air defense with anti-submarine warfare capabilities surpassing previous Chinese surface combatants. The Type 055 adopts a conventional flared hull with distinctive stealthy features. A continuous structure amidst ship increases internal volume and reduces radar cross-section. Chinese sources credit the design as being generally stealthy with reduced radar, noise, infrared and electromagnetic radiation signatures. Sensors include 4S-band type 346B active electronically scanned array radars, X-band radar, a bow hull mounted sonar and towed array sonar. The primary armament are missiles carried in 112 universal vertical launch cells, 64 cells forward and 48 cells aft. 
The 055 is equipped with double HQ-9 surface-to-air missiles, YJ-18 anti-ship cruise missiles, CJ-10 land attack cruise missiles, and missile launch anti-submarine torpedoes. Propulsive power is generated by four 28M WQC-280 gas turbines in combined gas and gas arrangements, and additional power may be provided by six 5M WQD-50 gas turbines. With this power, it provides a speed and range of 30 knots and 9,300 kilometers. The second most powerful guided missile ship today is the Oliver class, which is a guided missile destroyer used by the United States Navy around the Aegis combat system and the SPY-1D multifunction passive electronically scanned array radar. With a maximum length of 155.3 meters and a displacement of 9,700 tons and weaponry including over 90 missiles, the Arleigh class are larger and more heavily armed than most previous ships classified as guided missile cruisers. The warships were designed as multi-mission destroyers able to fulfill the strategic land strike role with Tomahawk missiles, anti-aircraft warfare role with powerful Aegis radar and surface-to-air missiles, anti-submarine warfare and towed sonar array, anti-submarine rockets and ASW helicopter, and anti-surface warfare with Harpoon missile launcher. The Arleigh design incorporates stealth techniques such as the angled rather than traditional vertical surfaces and the tri tripod mainmast, which makes the ship more difficult to detect, in particular by anti-ship missiles. The ship has an electronic warfare suite that provides passive detection and decoy countermeasures. The class's light airborne multi-purpose system helicopter system improves the ship's capabilities against submarines and surface ships. Powered with four General Electric LM2500 gas turbines, each generating 19,570 kilowatt, coupled to two shafts, each driving a five-bladed reversible controllable pitch propeller, it provides a speed of 30 knots. And now the most powerful guided missile ship in the world is none other than the Sejong the Great Class Destroyer, also known as KDX-3, which is a guided missile destroyer of the Republic of Korea Navy. At 166 meters in length and a displacement of 11,000 tons when fully loaded, the KDX-3 Sejong the Great Destroyers are by far the largest destroyers in the South Korean Navy and indeed are larger than most destroyers in the navies of other countries. The ship features the Aegis Combat System combined with ANSPY 1D multifunction radar antenna. KDX-3 are currently the largest ships to carry the Aegis Combat System. Sejong, the Great Class Destroyer's main gun is the 127mm L62 MK45 Mod 4 naval gun. Point defense armaments include 130mm Goalkeeper CIWS and the RIM-116 Rolling Airframe Missile Block 1 21-round launcher. Anti-submarine warfare armaments consist of both Red Shark anti-submarine rocket, which has same form to the USAS ROC and Blue Shark torpedoes. Destroyers of the Sejong the Great class have a capacity of 128 missiles as opposed to 96 on the Arleigh class and the Japanese Otago class destroyers. The Sejong the Great class is thus one of the most heavily armed ships in the world with even greater missile capacity than the Chinese People's Liberation Army Navy Type 055 destroyer or the US Navy's Ticonderoga class guided missile cruiser. Powered with four General Electric LM2500 COGAG and two shafts of 75,000 kilowatt, it ensures a top speed of 30 knots and a range of 5,500 nautical miles or 10,200 kilometers. And that was the list of the five most powerful guided missile ships in the world today. We hope you've enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and share and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thank you for viewing in.